Hello friends I am Muskan I hope you all are doing well and today's video is going to be about react native so let's get right into the video What is react native React native is an open source javascript framework React JS is the core of React native We can build cross platform application using javascript It is not limited to only iOS and Android. In fact, we can also develop Apple TV, VR, AR, Windows and desktop applications. It was released by Facebook in 2015. After release, it's gaining huge popularity. Many big companies adopt it and one of its advantage is code reusability. right once and run anywhere you can also check out official document for reference i will put link in the description Here is the sample code. Here we can see how we can import and use built-in functions. If you don't understand what is uh, written here, it's totally fine. I will explain every single line of code in upcoming videos. This is the tree structure of components. At the first, it will render app dot js, which have two child component, and so on. We have hot reload feature in React Native, which is my favorite. Here you can see if we change something in code, it will reflect instantly. these big companies using react native as their front end stack i recommend you to all to check out official document what is prerequisites if you want to learn react native then you should have basic knowledge of javascript Also we will use command line interface sometimes so you should be familiar with it basic understanding of npm and how it works environment setup we need node and npm installed in our system also need android studio and jdk version greater than 8 i will use Visual Studio Code you can use any other IDE Let's start it with node installation Open node.js.org in the browser and download node installer according to your operating system and install it after installation you can verify it by run command npm hyphen v in the command prompt If you get npm command not found then reinstall it
फोर जे डी के ओपन ओरिकल डॉट कॉम एंड डाउनलोड पैकेज अकॉर्डिंग टू योर ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम एंड इंस्टॉल इट डोंट फोगेट टू सेट पाथ लेट्स गो अहेड विथ एंड्रॉइड स्टूडियो इंस्टॉलेशन Go to the developer. dot android. dot com. And download the file and install it. Please make sure. You set the path for Android Studio and Android SDK. If you want to install Visual Studio Code, follow the section. Otherwise, you can skip it. Open code. dot Visual Studio. dot com and download the installer according to your operating system and install it. I will put all the links in the description box. If you want a video for complete installation and environment setup, let me know in the comment section. I will make dedicated video for it. Open command prompt and let's create our first React Native project. Go to the desired location. In my case, it's D drive. Create a directory. Go into it. First, we install React hyphen native hyphen CLI package. Using npm, with hyphen g for global installation. You can also use install instead of i for installation. Press enter to install. I already have it, so I am not gonna install it. Now run React hyphen native in it. Space with project name to create project. It will take some time, so I'm gonna fast forward it. After this, let's open this project in my favorite IDE, VS Code. I am hiding some information for client security.
This is the index.js file which render initially. Here it is importing ape component. And this is the sample code which will show in mobile application. Now open terminal. And run npm install for some dependencies which we required for react native project. It will take some time so wait for it. And then open emulator and run react hyphen native run hyphen android command it will install the application in emulator And you can test hot reloading feature by changing a uh, color and changing some text. It will reflect instantly into the emulator. So that's it for today. I hope now you know what is React Native and how can we create project with it. If you like my work, please do like, share and subscribe. See you in the next video.